Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all really, really safe and well. And in today's video, I'm going to be doing a different sort of video and doing a what is in my college bag. So if you guys didn't know, I go to a musical theatre college and there's so much stuff that I always need to bring because it's literally crazy. They're like, you've got this class next, you've got this next. My lead had breaks, so I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> so I'm going to be doing a what's in my bag for college. Um, Cause maybe if any of you guys are musical theatre students and you wanna know if you're going away or something like that. So yeah, I am in my second year of college um, in musical theatre and I'm hoping to move away next year if any of you are wondering. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's just hop right on into it. Okay, so as you guys know, I'm in lockdown. So some of this stuff um, has been taken out of my bag because sometimes I'll bring my rucksack to college and sometimes I will bring this bag. Mainly it's this bag, but if I'm going in just for like one lesson, cause sometimes on like a Tuesday we have one lesson and then, so if you guys are wondering, cause obviously with a lockdown. So currently I was in on a Tuesday and a Friday. So on a Tuesday I was in just for tap and singing and for Friday I was in for the full day which consists of um, jazz, contemporary, singing and acting but at the moment, oh sorry, so now we've just gone through the lockdown and now we've been informed that I'm in um, on Tuesday for tap and I'm in, there's another class that's been added but we don't know about yet and I'm in all day Thursday and all day Friday if you guys are curious. So obviously I'll be bringing this bag on the Thursdays and Fridays. So I got this bag for Christmas last year I want to say and it is a Nike like duffel bag sort of vibe. I can't zip this up. There we go. It's really really big. It fits loads of stuff in. It literally just goes over, over my shoulder like that and it's quite nice as well which I like because some of these bags they're just a bit like oh you don't want them. So yeah. So first of all is in this little mesh pocket. In this pocket there is nothing in there at the moment. But in this little um, mesh pocket at the side, I've got two masks that have been used, which I don't know why they're in there. They've got makeup stains all of them. I need to chuck them away. But um, two of their masks. And then I've got my reusable mask because I take the train to dance um, to college. So I got to wear a mask on the train. So if I ever forget one, I've got a spare one. But this one needs to go in the wash because, you know. And then I've got a hand sanitizer. This one's really, really good and it smells so nice. I just love it. And hand sanitizer and masks, they, they, this is all I need literally at the moment with Corona. But it's so good to just have a hand sanitizer because when I'm on the train and stuff, you know, there's no way where you can really wash your hands. And in and throughout classes, and obviously because it's dance, it's really hard. You want to like quickly switch to classes. So it'd be nice, to, it's just nice to have a little hand sanitizer. And then I've just got some spare change at the bottom and then I've also just got a pen with um, my college like logo on it just as an extra pen. Okay guys, so just moves a bit closer to be a bit more like, you know, because I feel like I was really far away. So this is the main part now. So this is mostly everything that I use. So I've got my mask, which has been cleaned and I put back in because um, it's a really, really pretty face mask and obviously throughout lessons you've got to put them on and I think it's really good to have at least three in your bag it sounds a bit over the top but I think if you lost one because you know if you I like one of my friends on the train she put it in her pocket and then she couldn't find it she lost it and it's just always good to have spare ones and these ones are really pretty and I really like the material ones um than these ones just because you've got to chuck these ones away and they just go a bit groggy so I like these ones I also like with this mask that it's got adjustable things because if any of you guys are like me if they really hurt my ears the masks do I don't know what it is please leave a comment down below if yours do as well because mine do I bought a new black one as well with the little adjustable things so that's great I got my favorite hairspray guys this is my favorite hairspray of all time it's the squash of poof <laughs> I don't know how to say that brand, but the glued one, this is unreal. And obviously in college we have to have, well, it's not compulsory, but we have to have like a slick back low pony. Um, and I like to be slick. So this hairspray is so good and it's a mini size as well, which is great. Um, it wasn't too expensive either for the brand, which is really good. And yeah, so I really, really like this hairspray and it's amazing. I'd recommend you buying it if you're a dancer. Then I've got my notebook. This notebook um, has literally got everything I need in there. All my work I've been doing online. So if, you know, my teacher's like, 
what did we do in that lesson, what did we do in that lesson, it's all in here. Or if I just need to take notes, mainly notes that we have to take around acting when we have to um, peer uh, assess each other's work and stuff. So it's just always to have a nice notebook. I couldn't tell you where I got this from. I got this from the works, that's where it was, the works. Um, which I don't even know if that's still open now, sadly, because of Corona. But um, really nice notebook, really pretty and really simple as well. So then I've got my acting uh, monologues in here. So um, if you guys don't know what monologues are, um, they are just basically what we, there's a piece of text from a play and it's what we need to have for our auditions. So this is basically what we do in acting class. And I've just got a load of different monologues in here, just in case my teacher's like, that one doesn't suit you or whatever. But I've actually got my one now, if you guys wanna know, it is Zuzu's monologue by Dance Nation. If you're curious, watch her on YouTube. Some people do it really, really good and I'm like, Oh, I wish I was you. Um, so yeah, this is my monologue for this year. I haven't actually performed it in front of my teacher yet and I'm kind of scared. I hope he likes it. But yeah, so just all my monologues in there just so I know I've got them because I like to have them. Then I've just got another notebook. This one's a bit bigger. Um, I've also stuck on it. My mum went to uh, Huda Beauty, Huda Beauty, Huda Beauty and she bought loads of stuff and they gave her these stickers and um my mum was like oh my god my daughter would love them and the lady's like oh here's another pack <laughs> so i've stuck them on here i've stuck them on my songbook as well hey, is that down here it is should i grab it for you guys it's because i was tucking it up the other day here we go. <laughs> so this is my songbook and this is my notebook oh they're so cute i love them um so in there is all my sheet music and in here is just more notes um university based colleges monologues uh places i want to go um certain work for like legit musicals and all that jazz if you guys aren't um in musical theater student you're probably thinking what is she on about but yeah so um this is normally in my bag as well it is my sheet music but this is my sheet music for the song that i'm singing my auditions so these are just old songs that I've had or songs we've had to do um, in college. Oh my God, I love this one. The, we got magic to do just for you. Yeah, guys, I'm not a singer. Let's, let's all, I'm a dancer, okay? Barely even dancer. <laughs> but uh, this is my sheet music for the song that I'm doing for my audition. And these are just some extra ones. And we've got panel day as well soon, so I've got to properly get on top of that. Okay, so that's all the work related stuff. So, got my purse so I can get food because I'm starving in college. Uh, this is just a River Island purse. And I normally bring my other one as well because my other one's a bit smaller. But in here I've got my train thing as well where I can put my train ticket, which is great. So I don't lose it because that's the worst thing, losing it. And it's got loads of space. I've got all my cards because sometimes after college, we'll go get food or whatever. So if you have like an early finish or whatever, why isn't it, there we go. So this is my purse, it's from River Island. And I've had this for quite a while and River Island purses last up for age as well. So I'd really recommend buying them if you're looking for, I mean, they're not cheap, cheap. This was about 30 pound, I think. Um, but compared to like a Louis Vuitton purse, <laughs> um, but yeah. It stays good for ages. Okay, so the next thing is my Victoria's Secret bag and everything that is in it has been tipped out. So normally what's in it is my lipstick and stuff, which I'll pass now, but I got this Victoria's Secret bag and in the moment, at the moment in it is just a tuft brush because you guys must probably like tuft brush, you weirdo. Um, if I can't, Sorry, got had a little notification. Um, if I forgot in my slicking brush, I'll use a toothbrush to get away any wispies. So I'll just spray it with some hairspray and just go like that. And this bag, I got this for Christmas. It's so cute and I love Victoria's Secret bags. I think they're so pretty. Um, and I'm guessing everything that's in it is gonna be just loose in the bag. I didn't sort this bag out before, guys, so just ignore. Okay, so my next little bag is this bag and this, is a life saving bag. Like, so if you guys are in any college, anything, I recommend you having a bag like this. 
So in this bag I have, I don't use these obviously in college, but I keep them um, if I'm having a really bad headache and like on my way home on a train or something, like I just want to put them on. They're like cooling gels for your head. I can take them out because they're they're all wrapped up. So basically you peel off that bit by there and you just put it on your head and it basically, if you've got a really bad headache, it really helps it and cools it down. And it literally, it's so good and I really, really like it. It says non-medical, soothing and comforting. And it comes with two and I used one. Um, I really, really recommend having these guys. They're amazing. I've mainly got these for auditions on my way home or my way there just in case i've got this little um emoji com coin purse inside of this bag and in there is just a carmex uh lip balm and a vaseline just in case because winter especially my lips get really really badly chapped okay so here's the medical stuff i got paracetamol um ibuprofen heartburn tablets because i get really really bad heartburn and being in any sort of pain like that during dance, you don't focus, you focus so much on the pain and then it just takes everything away because it's happened to me so many times. So having stuff like this is so good. Um, and another pack of ibuprofen as well. And it's good to have them for your friends as well. And there's so many times that I've had a really bad headache and my friends are like, oh, have a paracetamol. And I was feel really bad because I've never got them. So now I'm prepared. <laughs> and then I've got a mini pot of pseudocreme. Don't really know why, it's just so cute. Yeah, you can't argue with that. I'm sorry. And then I've just got some um, hauls, howls, hauls, uh, for a sore throat. Because obviously it's cold season, corona season. And also I won't go out if I had corona. But um, if I did have a sore throat or anything like that during the day, I would just take one of these. And then I've just got a little uh, thing of Bongella. Because ulcers and stuff like that are the worst. That's all I'm going to say. So yeah, guys, I really recommend anybody having a little medical bag. It doesn't take up much room and it's really, really good to have. Okay, so the next thing that I've got is really weird, actually. I don't know why I've got this in here. It's just a spare top. I always keep a spare top in my bag. Just a spare black top, like so. Just because... Um, in my college, obviously, we're all in leotards and stuff. And if I quickly need to, like, run to, like, the toilet or to get some food or something like that, I literally can chuck on joggers on a top. And if that day, like, I don't know, I only brought a coat or a jumper, which is very... Oh, I lost my top. I've got a spare one. It's very unlikely to happen, but it's just good to keep a spare black one. And a black one goes with most outfits, with all outfits, and it's just good to have. And I also have a spare sports bra in here which is just this black Puma one because I've had experiences where my bra has broken. <laughs> and I'm gonna leave that at that for you. Um, so just keep a spare one in there as well, just in case. Okay, so um, then I've also got my ballet shoes, which are, I need a new pair, that's all I'm gonna say. I bought these from Block Guys and they lasted years. Uh, they're really, really small on me now. And as you can tell, they are wrecked. I need new ones for auditions, but I just keep them in there just in case because I remember we had a workshop last year and we were doing ballet and I forgot my ballet shoes so since then I've literally just kept them in this bag because that would just be a nightmare okay so I've got my slick and brush which is what I'll use um instead of the tough brush I'm gonna put these back so these are all the things that are meant to be in this bag so my slick and brush this is from Primark if you guys are wondering super good it was literally like a pound not even that and it's amazing I really recommend you buying it I got this mini um impulse spray because I have actually don't have any sprays in here because I just chucked out my Victoria's Secret one and need to get another one um so a little mini impulse spray because you're gonna be <laughs> okay this this is the thing you need in dance college everybody deodorant i've got a big one because you need it i'm sorry to anybody who's like oh no you need this it's so good um the sure one mixed opinions uh i prefer dove and the mitchell ones i've got the mitchell one over there um but this is just good for your college bag it's a good deodorant it's just like I prefer the other ones. Oh my god, she was gonna come at me as if they watch my videos. <laughs> Anyways, um, 
So yeah, also in that bag, I was meant to keep my lip liner. So it is, again, not compulsory, but we like to wear red lipstick in class. Because I love it. I love wearing red lipstick in class. People are like, ew. But I love it. I feel really, like, theatrical and I'm, like, ready to go if I've got my red lip on. Um, so this, you're going to find really odd. <laughs> this is a straw that my singing teacher gave me. Now, guys, I'm not the singer. And my whole year knows that. And my teacher tries to help me, bless his little soul, so much on singing. So he gave me a straw. I don't really understand what I have to do with it. He did tell me. I've really forgotten. If he's watching this video, he's going to be like, Karen. Um, but, yeah, we did an exercise with it. Anywho. Um, so I've got two more hairsprays, but they're literally running out. I used, the other one that I got is new. I love this one. This is the L'Oreal um, Extreme Hold. Really, really good hairspray. Really recommend. And this one is the VO5 Ultimate Hold Spray. I've actually had this for so long um, and it's really, really good because I keep an extra one in here just in case my friends need one. And I'm like, I got you, girl. So, yeah. The next thing that I've got is this bag. Now, guys, this is a Zoella bag. Yours probably like, you're an OG, I know, what can I say? Um, but in this bag is basically um, a pack of makeup wipes. Um, they're really, really dried out. I'm most probably going to chuck these away and put a new packet in there. But I bought these ages ago, they're so dry. But I keep uh, makeup wipes in there because as much as I said how much I love having the red lipstick on, it can get really annoying and really gritty and... Ugh. So I keep makeup vibes. And then also in here are just some pads because I'm a girl and if you find this weird, then you're weird. I feel like people find talking about pads and stuff so weird and I'm like, well, I'm a girl. Gonna have a period, sorry. Do you get me? Like, um, well, I went a bit deep then. <laughs> but yeah, and these are good just in case any of my friends need them as well. Cause yeah, that's what you need in life. Okay. Then I've got the red lipstick. This is the Collection Velvet Kiss one. And I really, really like this one. I did have the MAC, um, oh God, liquid one, but I lost it, which is really, really sad. So I'm hoping to get another one soon or for Christmas or something. But as a substitute, it's really, really good. It smells really, really nice. It smells like, like candy, which is great. Okay guys, so there's not much left before you guys are like, you're boring me to death. <laughs> so I've got a dry shampoo. Um, don't really need a dry shampoo because your hair is um, in a slick anyways, but just in case afterwards, someone's like wanna go for food or something and I'm just feeling a bit icky. I've just got this dry shampoo and this one's really, really good, especially for my hair because it's so dark. I hate the um, the one that's the original one because it makes my hair go gray. With this one, at least it's got a bit of tint so it's not too bad. And then I've got my lanyard, but I don't want to show that because it's got my college on it. But what I've got on my lanyard is my name. I usually keep my um, train tickets in there, my key for my house and my little charm. I don't want to show you, but um, my charm that I share with my best friend. It says best effing beaches on there and she's got the other half. It's like a cute little, cute little heart. Okay, then I've got my Chili's bottle. It's such a good bottle, guys. I really recommend investing. I got this one. Um, it's like a really pretty purple one. This is amazing because it keeps your drink cold. And during class, the worst thing is a hot drink. Well, not like a hot drink, but like, ugh, do you know my biggest pet peeve? Lukewarm drinks. I can't deal with them. I can't. I can't face them. They freak me out. I have to have either like ice cold or at least cold, I can't have anything else. Like if I'm gonna have a hot drink, I'll have a hot chocolate. <laughs> Do you get me? So with these bottles, if you get cold water, they keep it cold all day, which is great. Um, Only three things left, I just, oh, four. I've got a pack of polos because always great for after food and stuff just before you go into class, if you just wanna freshen up. A hairbrush, which is what you need in every college bag. My hair is not really straight today because yeah, we just won't talk about it. <laughs> and then we got a mini lint roller because my friend Chesney, she's definitely watched this right now, I love you girl. She always had a lint roller. I remember I always used to come in because what I do, so for college guys, we have to wear leotard and tights. And um, obviously you'd wear leotard and tights and then you wouldn't wear that to the train station. You'd put on like joggers and a jumper and stuff. And I'd always wear gray joggers and they would always 
the grey joggers would always get like little bobbly bits on my tights and my friend always had a lint roller and then I found this baby one so I picked it up and bought it because they're really really good and this year she hasn't actually been in my class because we've been in other sides of the year but she's coming back with me next week and I love you Chesney girl and this is why I bought this <laughs> for you so yeah a little lint roller and I also think this is a good thing for any bag like because I always get like cat hair and stuff from my baby pretty and the last thing are my airpods um this is my little airpod case it did have a cute little starbucks cup but i lost it i think this is there or something but airpods always good to have um if i'm on the train in the morning one of the girls natea brie y'all the verdict for this if she's like oh, i'm getting on the later train i'm like ah <laughs> love you girl so i'm on the early train on my own or something or if I just get a train on my own or something, I hate just being Cylon. So having my AirPods with me is always great. So that is everything in my bag for college. So yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I thought it'd be really, really fun to make. And I miss like what's in my bag and stuff. So anyone else, I said love them videos because I'm a little nosy little girl. Um, so yeah, I really got, hope you guys enjoyed this week's video. I hope it gave you some inspiration if you need anything. And obviously I'm going back to college next week so I thought this would be the perfect video to do. So thank you guys so much for watching my video. That is my cat, if you just hear my thud. <laughs> and I love you guys so much. Thank you for all the support and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.